Hello friends, this is Durga again from IT Varsity, a one-stop shop to learn all the technologies. In this video, um, they are asking to define a hive table from a select query. Okay, And also if you look at uh, the other uh, uh, two learning objectives, they are also saying define a hive table that uses the ORC file format and create a new ORC file table from the data in an existing non-ORC file hive table. So we will club all these three things and we will see how we can actually create a hive table from a select query in which we will define the file format um, and also we will query uh, a non ORC file hive table to load data into this new table which will be created okay so let's see so if you go through the syntax here when it comes to creating a table by selecting data from another table, uh, which is called a CTAS in standard uh, database programming, which stands for create table as select. So after create table, you cannot specify the uh, create table table name, you cannot specify the column name. The column names will be inherited from the, uh, the query itself and even the data types. You cannot customize in case of uh, Hive. In traditional RDBMSS, in some of the RDBMSS like Oracle, you can define your own columns while selecting from a table, which is not possible in Hive. And then if you look at the other, uh, other uh, learning objective, they are saying define a Hive table that uses the ORC file format. And also we, we have to insert uh, the data into the table. So if you want to define the columns, um, we, uh, as regular uh, ORC table, you just say create table, table name, give the column names and then at the end stored as ORC. It will create the table and then you can load the data using insert command. Okay, in this case we will mix um, uh, uh, these three. So we will try to do the CTAS while defining the table as ORC file and then we will load into the table. The syntax is very simple use create table okay and orders we will use the same table ORC and we cannot specify the column names like this because we are trying to select data from uh, another source but you can specify all the um, uh, most of the other parameters there are certain limitations you can play with those things like partition by all those things might not be uh, might not work let's do that partitioned by in this case uh, i want to partition by yeah it will not work uh, a partition by will not work we will try to use clustered by order id even in, this might not work but we will see order id into 16 buckets so we are trying to do the bucketing and then we want to say row format delimited fields terminated by in this case I want to give comma as the delimiter or colon as the delimiter okay and then stored as what they are asking they are asking for ORC so you can give like this and then select star from orders retail space dot orders and hit enter okay yeah here i have to define as also as select c task create table all the table properties and then as select okay so create table row format stored as orc and then as and then select see it is saying it does not support partitioning in the target table so except for the partitioning you can leave the rest of the stuff as is create table table name you cannot specify the column names or partition by or clustered by or skewed by and then define row format if you want to customize the uh, field de uh, delimiters to a different value than the default and then stored as ORC or whatever file format you want to use because we are uh, clubbing all the three and uh, uh, defining it as stored as ORC uh, I am just using stored as ORC and then select from retail stage dot orders again I forgot to 
add as in between so create table sorry again i'm using the wrong one so create table table name row format stored as as and then select and hit enter now it is running the map reduce job it will create the table orders underscore orc with the column names as selected from the source table and it, it will have the matching data types and then you will see the metadata about what is the uh, field terminator what is the file format etc okay so this is the location under which data will be copied to okay you can say dfs minus ls paste hit enter and you can see it has created one file over there because there is no partitioning or anything and if you want to see the properties of the new table you can say describe formatted orders orc and hit enter you can see the field del delimiter is semi col uh, sorry colon and uh, uh, you can see survey library is orc survey was uh, input format is orc input format and output format is orc output format so these three will be determined by the stored as clause while creating the table so if you want to uh, uh, use a, a custom input format and output format other than what are specified in the syntax um, which are the sequence file text file rc file orc parquet tower etc you have to um, understand the classes for survey input and output format and you have to use those things as part of the syntax so if you are struggling about uh, creating the table with the custom formats and if they have asked as part of the certification what you can do is you can say show create table orders underscore orc and hit enter it will give the complete syntax so even though while creating the table we said stored as orc if you see the input format and output format are different so you can actually change those things at the time of creating the table okay and uh, uh, once you get this if you want to add survey you can say um, row format delimited fields terminated by uh, for, uh, for survey you don't need to uh, means if you are using the custom survey you uh, which means you will be specifying like this okay if you don't use the uh, this one uh, it will show row format survey and uh, uh, survey name either you will use that one or the delimited in this case we are using the delimited that's why it is not showing up the survey okay if you want you can just say like this and then stored as orc so in this case i have to change the table name it will fail because the table already exists so i will be creating another table orc01 or default survey okay and then we will copy paste from here to here and stored as orc and hit enter and then you can say show create table the table name and hit enter you can see now the row format is survey okay typically for orc and all we should not specify the row format delimiter the custom delimiter only for text file uh, it is more relevant and sequence file uh, i think even for sequence file it is not that relevant only for text file a row format is highly relevant for others it will internally maintain the metadata so you don't need to worry about it okay so uh, already we have seen ctas uh, and we have demonstrated on orc directly uh, so that we don't need to record the uh, additional videos for those smaller items if you want to load data into the existing table it's simple insert into table name or insert uh, into overwrite table name select star from the source which we have seen as part of the partitioning and uh, uh, ha bucketing hence i will not be uh, showcasing that here i hope you uh, you understood how to insert data from the existing tables by looking at the earlier videos that being said i hope you are enjoying the content on the channel if you like this video please click on the like button if you want to provide the feedback please use the comment section of the video and if you have any technical questions use the stack overflow with appropriate tags if you 
want to discuss further about the certifications or big data please join my linkedin group called itversity hyphen certifications or itversity hyphen big data and finally if you are not subscribed to my channel yet please do so you will get to see a lot more content like this over time thank you bye